Hey guys, here's another step for the movie poster series. All right, so in the last video, I incorporated this cityscape into our poster. And basically the reason why we're doing that is because eventually I'm going to dilapidate it, destroy it in certain places, and make it look like it's abandoned and post-apocalyptic. We've got the city in there and we've got it behind the mountains, but it looks really out of place. So we're gonna start taking the steps necessary to make it seem more in place. So just to give you an idea, I'm going to zoom in and I'm going to show you how it just looks really out of place. Notice that the cityscape's resolution is much higher than the actual mountains. And while they're both high resolution images, I've scaled this down so it makes it look ridiculous. We want to change that. We want to fix that. But the first thing we're going to do is we are going to better incorporate this layer of the mountains to make it so there's no obvious elements of sky. Since this is not a mask, it is a layer, we're going to select the layer and we're going to select the eraser tool. You press E or on the toolbar, it's right here. So really, really simple. Make sure your flow is not quite 100% so it gives a little bit of a, a melding effect and then just go over the little areas. over everything you do not want that blue in there and just go over the little areas around the city itself you'll notice that it reveals parts of the city which is a good thing and I'm relatively satisfied with that that's pretty good I'm happy with that so now the next thing we want to do is select our cityscape and we want to start changing it. There's a few ways to do that which I've already covered in the other videos with the other layers such as changing the color balance, brightness and contrast, and the saturation. I am going to go through that again just to remind you but I'm going to start adding effects. Effects are really really helpful. There's so many of them and you can use them to create a better image and in this case an image that is well incorporated into the poster. So start with color balance image adjustments color balance this is mostly yellow and brown poster so we're gonna do that too much a little too much that's pretty damn that's pretty darn close but let's get it even closer let's change the shadows get them a little bit more desolate just want to make this look city look dead in the desert really so that's pretty good, but it's a little oversaturated. So we're going to go to brightness and contrast first. We're gonna up the contrast so it looks a little bit more, makes it pop a little more. Drop the brightness a little bit so it's not too bright. It's okay. Image adjustments, hue and saturation. Drop the saturation a little bit. Now it really looks like it's blended in at least as far as colors go. So now that we've used the different coloring and saturation tools to make the city blend into the poster better, we're going to continue that by using the actual effects that Photoshop has to offer. Check out the next video.